Hello everyone, this is James and welcome to my channel, JKP Origins. And today, I'm going to talk about a show that I never finished, a show that's been on my mind for a while, and yeah, it's a show that I just never unfortunately finished, and it's called Rain Series 3. And it's been a long time since I talked about this on my channel. The last time I talked about this was, I think, in June of 2017. It might have been July. So it's almost been three years since I addressed this show. And unfortunately, uh, it's like the same type of video that I made a long time ago, which is just talking about it and not releasing episodes or talking about the production like actual production and yeah like yeah i mean it's like it's like almost two o'clock in the morning over here i should be sleeping but instead i'm talking about this i was um getting ready for bed and i just i for whatever reason i just wanted to like i got like i just started watching like my old machinimas that i made because like series two came out seven years ago like over seven years ago and, like, that blew my mind that it's been that long. Not all of it, because, like, this May... Or, no, this June will be, like, seven years since the last episode came out. But we're talking six to seven years ago this show came out. And that blew my that blew me away. And then the first episode of Series 3 I released was, like, May 1st, 2015. So we're coming up on five years since I released that episode. And it's been almost three years since I last talked about it so so much time has gone by and it just kind of blew me away on how long it's been and looking back I'm really disappointed in myself that I never finished this show like this is the one thing that really bothers me that I just never I just couldn't do it I just couldn't finish it and there is hope in this video, but again, I've talked about making this show for so long and nothing has happened. And I just don't want to give false hope, mostly to myself, that like, oh, well, it's still coming out. And it's like, okay, like, where is it, bro? Um, so in this video, I, I, I don't know, like the fact that I'm talking about Rain, I think is, is kind of crazy because it's been so long and I don't know, I feel like I owe it to myself to explain what the hell happened and where are you today? Like, what's going on with me? What's going on with this show? Like, what, what happened? So, I know what happened and I'm going to be honest. <laughs> I mean, I, I should be honest, right? But uh, I'm, I'm going to be very brutally honest to myself and call out exactly what went wrong and why nothing has been happening. And it, it sucks because it's weird because, like, if I don't care about something, like, if the passion's not there, then it's almost impossible for me to do the, the project. And, you know, I know I got burnt out on YouTube and I've been on break for this weird vacation that's going indefinitely for now, like, and, yeah, like, I, it's just been weird, like, it's been really weird thinking back about all the stuff that I, that, that, especially all the stuff that's happened between the show and my life, and... Yeah, when the first episode of Series 3 came out, that was May 1st, 2015, like, a lot has happened in my life within those almost five years. Uh, not to get too dramatic, but my dad passed away, my mom passed away in 2019, uh, I graduated my, my community college, I'm getting really close to graduating my university, I swapped around multiple jobs, I went through multiple girlfriends, I say multiple girlfriends, mostly just two. <laughs> Um, a lot has happened to me. I've battled with, uh, working out a lot, not working out a lot, um, a lot of family problems, dealing with death, you know, dealing with the loss of my parents, that's been really hard for me, and there's just been a lot of drama in my life. No, I wouldn't say drama. There's been a lot of commotion, there's been a lot of activity going on in my life, and that was all, that was a big reason why I just never got around to finishing this show. But it's not the only reason. The biggest reason why was I just got lazy. 
Like, I'm gonna put it out there. I got lazy. And I procrastinated a lot. And it bothers me to say that because... Like, again, like, if I don't care about something, like, I'm out. I'm out. But for whatever reason for this show, like, there's still, like, something in myself that's, like, I want to finish this show. Like, there's something in my in my soul or my body or my mind where it's like there's still a fire there there's it may not be as ignited as it was in the past but it's still active and again like i feel like i'm just bullshitting myself because it's like i want to finish this show but here i am almost five years later and nothing has happened i'm drinking water sorry um Nothing has happened. And that really disappoints me. That really disappoints me. Um, I know what went wrong. <laughs> like, Series 1 was so simple. Such a simple concept. Not many characters. Super simple plot. Three episodes. Easy. Series 2 was literally double that. It was six episodes... Like, way more... I mean, the plot was still very simple, but, like, the action scenes, like, it just got... It ramped up, right? Series 3, I had so many characters. I had so many ideas. And I just did way too much. Um, I really did way too much. I just... The show got so big that it was just very hard, if not impossible, for me to do everything by myself. And... Yeah, it just... Like, I think the first episode took me almost a year to make, and it was an hour and 43 minutes, and I go back and watch it, and I'm cringing at some parts now. Because I, I, I feel like, that back then, that was the third iteration, and what I mean by iteration, it's like, I went through, like, rewrites, and um, I had a falling out with a bunch of people. I forget when, I think it was, like, 2013, I had a falling out with some people, and I wanted to make this third season a rain like so dramatically different that it could sit by itself on its own and it had nothing to do with the past two seasons. It did, but it didn't in terms of the creation. And I just went so far in the opposite direction and I really like what I came up with, with with the third iteration and then eventually I made a fourth iteration and now I think I'm on iteration five. So the show's gone through multiple rewrites and yeah, it's been it's been a long like this has been a long a long journey. I, I really I'm really I again like I'm I'm very disappointed in myself that I never got around to finishing this show. Like I don't think about it all the time, but now that I'm doing a video like this, it really bothers me. It really bothers me that I just never finished it. And I said I wanted to and I said I would and I just never did and that really bothers me. I think that's the one thing on this channel that I never really got over. It's like I never finished Rain. Like this is a show I cared about. I had so many ideas. And it's so messed up because it's like I still know how I want to end the show. And it's like no one's known this for years except me. And I know there's not really that many fans out there of the show. But there still are people out there that enjoyed it and... That was enough for me to keep it going back then, and I feel like I let those fans down. It's like, I've been teasing you guys for so many years, like, oh, it's coming out, it's coming out, it's coming out, and nothing to show for, and that upsets me a lot. Um, so, I don't know, why am I making this video? Because <laughs> I feel like, in some extent, it's just another fluff video, you know? But I don't want it to be fluff, I want it to be substance. Um... As everyone knows, there's a current pandemic going on in the world, and it's literally turned the world upside down. And uh, I now have way more free time than I've had in a long time. Now, I'm not saying I'm making sh the show right now, because I'm not in any position to start making the show again. But, I have a lot of time to write. And I think... So... Getting this out of the way, this has been a show that I've been thinking about for a long time. Um, it's a show that I've always wanted to go back to and finish, but either life got in the way or I just didn't have the passion to make it, and I just never did because I just can't make something I'm not into. It just, I just can't do it. It's so not me. 
But this is a show that's been on my mind for a very long time. And I do, you know, I do have moments where I'm really dedicated to making it. And then I have moments where I just don't care about it anymore. And that sucks because I know I do care about this show. But I guess what I'm trying to say is um, I also want to talk about Halo and, and, and like 343's involvement with that because that was a, another big reason why I just I just didn't want to make the show because I was just so disgusted with how Halo was being treated. It, it was so bad that like I couldn't look at the old Halos the same. I, I just couldn't look at Halo Reach the same like I used to and that really bothered me. I was just so upset with how where the direction was going and back then, like this is like around Halo 5, 2016, 2017, I was just like, I, I was just like, I'm done with this, sh sh with this game series. Like I'm just gonna walk away and I think it was one of the best things I did because I haven't really played Halo that much since then, I've only really played the old Halos and still it's just not the same anymore. And I know Halo Infinite's coming out, and I'm still up to date on, like, all the information about Infinite, but I'm very cautious. Like, it sucks, man. Like, it's, like, Bungie really set a very high standard with Halo, and I, I think 343 has dropped the ball so many times. Um, Halo 4, in my opinion, was, looking back on it, like, this is eight years ago. Um, Halo 4 was okay. Uh, as like a whole, you know, with the campaign and I wasn't a big fan of the campaign. Um, Halo 5 was a disaster. I thought the multiplayer was fun, but the campaign was just so bad and it really kind of broke the, the fandom. Uh, and then the infamous Master Chief Collection was just disastrous. Like, I think that was the... I think the Master Chief Collection was the one that really just... I mean, Halo 5 was the game that made me walk away from the series, but the MCC did a ton of damage. And I know it's fixed now, and that's awesome, but man, back in the day, I sound so old, back in 2014, it was rough. It was really rough, and I never really got over it. <laughs> um, I mean, I got over the fact that the game was fixed, but... The emotional trauma, and I'm not trying to sound dramatic and like feel bad for me, but that really made me look at Halo differently, and it sucks because this is a, sh a series that I fell in love with and I loved, and this was a series that I just I was so into. I was such the I was the biggest Halo fan, and now I barely play Halo, and I don't really think about Halo and it's just and it's not for the wrong reasons like it's not because I'm busy or because I'm occupied it's because I don't care anymore and that's the worst part that really is the worst part but I feel like with time uh, a lot of good can come from that I can take time to reflect I can take time to think I can take a break and that's exactly what I've been doing uh, I haven't really been up to date on Halo in a long time. I do occasionally look at some infinite news. So I am curious about that game and uh, it's been in development for like five years now, which makes me happy because it's like, okay, like you have, like if infinite, com if Halo Infinite comes out and if it's a mess like MCC or Halo 5 is, then I'm, I'm, I'm probably done. <laughs> like. There's only so many times that I can stick with a company. There's only so many times I can get burned, you know? And I want Infinite to be a success. Like, I would love to see Halo come back and be, like, what it used to be. Like, I don't want the series to die. But I've just been so fucked around with 343 that I just... It's really hard for me to not be skeptical and the reason why I'm talking about Halo Infinite is because a big reason to why I haven't gone back to Halo Reach and developed more rain is because Halo Infinite's coming out and say Halo Infinite is an amazing game and it's a great Halo game and it puts the series back on top 
What if Halo Infinite has, like, amazing machinima capabilities? Um, I would much rather prefer to make Rain in a much more updated Halo game with way more assets, that would help, which, which would make my life a lot easier. Um, so, like, Halo Reach is a great machinima game to make stuff in, but it's so old that it's really outdated in a lot of ways. And if Halo Infinite comes out and has all these mechanics, like, why wouldn't I want to make it in Halo Infinite? So, I don't know any machinima capabilities at the moment with Halo Infinite. Like, I have no idea if they're even going to put stuff in Infinite for machinima. I have no idea. So, it's a total, total, like, guessing game right now. But here's what I'm proposing to myself. And this is something that I did back when I made Series 2. Um, back when I made Series 2, I made Episodes 1, 2, and 3 back to back. And then I think I took a multiple months off before I got at working on Episode 4, 5, and 6. And a friend I had talked to at the time said, Release Episodes 1, 2, and 3. And then use that as motivation to finish 4, 5, and 6. Because once the episodes are out, it's like you have to finish the show anyway. And, and, and back then I was already getting burnt out on Series 2 and... Three, again, I just made three more stressful for myself. So, here's what I'm going to do. Because that worked back then for Series 2. Now, granted, I was like, what? This was like seven years ago. I was like 26 now. I was like 19 years old when I made that. So, a lot has happened in seven years. And I have more responsibilities now. And I work a lot. I'm still very fortunate that I have a job during this pandemic. But I do have... Life's just so much different now. It's just... I'm a totally different person, but my, my, my passion for Rain Series 3 has definitely dimmed, but it's not dead, and, and like, it sounds, like, I don't, I feel like I'm fake when I sound that, because it's like, well, if it didn't end, man, like, why didn't you create it? But I just, I mean, I, there's really no excuse other than me. Like, I just lost the passion, and a lot have happened, and I just... I just gave up, and that's really, it really sucks for me to, to admit that, but that's the truth, like, that's why the show never came out, I gave up on it, and I wanna, I, I wanna, if there's one thing that I would, if, if there's one thing I could do on YouTube, and just, like, if I had to do, like, say I, I walked away from YouTube and I never came back, but I, but I could only do one thing. That one thing would be to finish Series 3. Like, that's the one thing I think I would love to do, is just finish this show. And just say, it took forever, but I did it. I did it. I finished it. And that would be something that I would be so happy about. Um, and I would totally still make a machinima. Like, I know I'm into filmmaking now, and I do a lot of live-action projects, and I haven't made machinima in, like, five, or, like, five, six, or, like, four to five years, but I would totally make Rain into a machinima, <laughs> which, I don't know, it might be kind of fun going back and being like a 27 year old, 26, 27 year old making machinima, it's like nostalgia, but also kind of sad, but not really, but yes, no offense to people who make machinima, I think, just, for me, it's like, it's kind of weird, um, but, um, that strategy worked with Series 2, so I'm going to try this for Series 3. I'm going to call myself out. I'm calling myself out. Like I'm putting this out on the table right now because this is me calling myself out, and I'm now holding myself to this quote-unquote promise. I'm, fuck, fuck the quotes. I'm holding myself out to this promise that I'm telling everyone right now. Um, the coronavirus, and now my video is demonetized. I don't care. My The coronavirus... <laughs> has ravaged at least I, I i live in i live in the i live in the united states and it has ravaged our country and it's kind of scary but um because of it uh not much I, I have a lot more free time right now um than i ever had before and i could be writing it like that, that's the thing like if i can't make the show i can at least write out the entire series so I am hoping that Halo Infinite has machinima capabilities like Halo Reach, but just more. Just more of everything. 
if there's I know there's gonna be split screen if there's four players split screen and it just has all the stuff of reaches machinima but just so much more then I want to make rain series 3 in, in Halo Infinite and I know it's not coming out to the fall of this year but <laughs> I'm still in university I'm not graduating until uh, May 2021 and after I finish school, I'll never go back to school ever again. I got my degree. I'm done. So, I'll have more free time next summer. Um, this summer, I'm probably just going to work a lot. But, as I said, the coronavirus has really slowed a lot of things down, which means I have way more time to write things. And my promise to myself is my goal between now and when I graduate in 2021 in May my goal is to write out the entire series 3 just write out the entire show I'm not talking about outlining I'm saying writing out the scripts from episode 1 to how many I decide to make I want to write out the entire series before I graduate or by the time I graduate that way when I graduate I'm gonna have a lot of free time because I have no more school Halo Infinite would have been out for almost a year and I can really dive deep and just try to knock this show out. This is a show that I've had on my mind for a long time. This is a show that I've always wanted to finish that I just never did and it bothers me that I never did and here is a promise to myself that I'm throwing out there in the open to hold myself accountable. I want to finish writing the entire show by next May not this May a year from like uh, like 13 months from now essentially I want to I want to write the entire series out and then I want to make it an infinite if Halo Infinite doesn't have mission capabilities well fuck uh, then I'll probably just go back to Halo Reach and I'll figure it out but I want to write out the entire series um, <laughs> it's probably going to be like all new characters and I mean all new voice actors and I don't know, like, it's been a long time since I worked on this show, but this is something that has been just on my mind for years. And this video is just a way for me to be like, you know what? Let's just, let's see, let's just make it. I'm making a video at 2 o'clock in the morning. I should be sleeping, but here I am talking about a show that I haven't worked on in forever, but it's a show that I just desperately care about, but... I, I just haven't shown that respect like I should, and here's the first respect that I'm showing to it in a while. Uh, so I guess I'll quote myself from almost three years ago. No, the show's not dead. So, in my opinion, when something's cancelled, it means you're done working on it, and you're just never gonna go back to it. But I've gone back to Ring and like, very sporadically, but I've gone back and I've just kind of poked around like I, I haven't given up on the project but I have but I haven't I don't know maybe I'm in denial maybe the show was cancelled and I just never maybe the show is cancelled I, I, I don't know but I'm reviving it like I want to write out the entire series and I, I want to make it I want to make it like honestly this is something that I want to fucking make like this is the one if I had to do one more thing on YouTube this is it. This is it. I want to make Series 3. I want to tell the fucking story I had in my mind for years. I want to finish this show. This is a show that I just... I know I care about it. <laughs> and it's like I'm trying to convince myself that I do. But I know I do. I think I just... I'm trying to convince you guys because nothing's happened. But... <sighs> yeah, so this is a... Sh the that's my plan. I'm not even going to edit this video. I'm going to upload this video raw commentary. Like, I want to finish this show. I'm going to write out the entire series before I graduate or by the time I graduate next May 2021. And I pray that Halo Infinite has machinima capabilities. If it does, if it comes out later this year and it has machinima capabilities, that's the sign. That's the sign. So... My name is James. This is my YouTube channel, JKP Origins. Rain Series 3 
has been on hiatus for a long time. And you know what? It's time for me to get my shit together and thaw it out. Because I wanna I wanna bring the show back to life. And it's gonna start with pre-production, which is writing the show out. Thank you for watching. Um, if you guys watch the whole video, uh, you're awesome. And please, please let me know your thoughts. Like, I hope I'm not the only one that cares about this show. I, I want to know, like, if there's even, like, two people out there that like the show. Like, that's enough to be like, I gotta do it for me, but also you guys. So, thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more Deus Ex reactions. But until then, Rain Series 3, I'm bringing it back to life. See you soon.